Hey guys, welcome to part 9. On the last episode, uh, we took on this night flight challenge thing. And actually, went by pretty well, actually. Confronting Dr. Shemp. 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 The music. It is suspicious. It reminds me of something, but I can't think of it. It's a witch doctor! <laughs> and you fail! Oh, she's not having any of that. But she will have that. How much money is here? Alright. Wait, 300? One dragon? You got it. You cannot get by me with your oddly clad women who are very mean to their husbands, who I presume are their husbands, who are most likely not their husbands, who are just random slaves. Ah, she beat me away. Oh, this is a bad place. Situational report. Curses. I was hoping to like, jump. Okay. Money, money, money. Whoa, no, no. Get me back down. I need to get back down. Why? Why? What's wrong? That's why. And that's why. She would have been. She's perfectly situated to push me off a cliff. Okay, take me up there. First off, this. Okay. Secret one. I would have put a dollar there. The sand. Oh, I missed one back there. That looks like a doctor. Okay. You do that, Spyro. Alright, this area looks clear. Hi, doctor. I'll get to you in a little bit. But first, it's time. For whatever I was about to say. To go down. Rescue Trondo. This guy thinks he's so cool. You don't know what it's been like listening to him over and over. But I'll tell you one thing. He should watch his back. No. You mean his back is unarmored? <laughs> yes, stupid. That's exactly what he meant. His back is unarmored. <laughs> Oh wow, that did no good, okay. Time for a checkup, Doctor. I like this better than the sheep, though. The sheep was just like... And those dogs kicked my butt. It's time, Doctor Man. I gotta escape. No, 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 no. Ah, dang it. All right, let's try this again. Yeah. 
No, no, Dr. Man. Gotcha. I'm doing this all in one round. Gotcha! Victory is mine! So the first time, he'll just kind of look at you and try to hit you. The second time, he'll like, turn around and then hit you. So the trick is like, to set yourself up. And then let him hit you. And then thirdly, his last- Oh! No! 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 <sighs> Don't make me kill him again. Okay, good. And then thirdly, his final attack involves, um, what was I gonna say? Words. His final attack is he'll try to, like, sweep the ground. That's why I couldn't dodge him. So you just got, um, thing. You got a thing. You got to jump and then hit him. Please be a 50. Please be a 50. Not complete, but we're close. Nope. Now to sprint around until I find something. Wait, that was it! I saw it! I saw it! What other block is this high? Ah, oh, phew! Alright. I was actually thinking of that platform, but they mean the other one, so... Okay. Come on. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Yeah, son. It starts tipping over. <laughs> yeah, son. Perfection. Jump! Oh yeah! Perfect! Ready to go! $300! We're doing good! Alright, now that Dr. Shemp's taken care of, all we need to do is get to the next place. However, I'll save that for next episode, because I kind of like having like the wonderment. Let's see. Gosnell the Blueness says we can go to the Magic Crafters. Does anyone have any idea what that even means? No. What it entails? No. Anything? No. Well, okay then. Well, on the next episode, what's a magic crafter? They craft magic. What kind of magic? Magic, magic, really? Magic, 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 really? Yes. So, see you then.